Yo guys, you get it here. Before we get into the video, I just want to tell you guys to go subscribe to my new Lofi Beast channel called Enchantly. And it is absolutely amazing, guys. I just uploaded my first video. I think about three hours ago it's got like seven views it was originally on my other channel but i posted it on this channel guys but i want you guys to blow this up i'm talking about 400 subs probably in the next two weeks guys and i'm gonna be doing a massive giveaway if we can hit that goal without further ado enjoy the video stay tuned if you want to do this Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to yet another beautiful Jigeti video. And today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can double your editing speed on controller. And this does work for PC and console. But without further ado, let's get into the first tip. All right, guys. So the first tip I want you guys to do is just go into your settings right here. And I want you guys to scroll over here and then turn on edit on release, guys. This right here helps you out so much because I know a lot of you guys do not play on double binds. Uh, and this option is on for a, a console too, if you guys want to use that, because a lot of you guys be like, oh, I want some more console tips, or we need console tips rather than PC, or you mentioned anti-micro every single video, which I do because it does help you guys out. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys some ways how you can do this on console and on PC. So uh, if you guys want to go and turn this on rather than off, because if you have it on, it's going to help you out so much because it's literally, you don't have to press another button. It's knocking out another button that you have to place so you know your edit button how you press it twice to confirm to uh, select it and then confirm it yeah you won't have to do that with this on and it just helps out so much guys also have turbo building on because this does help out and for our pc players over here what i want you guys to do is you see right here where it says xbox ps4 and generic i want you guys to scroll down and click it on generic this does reduce input delay guys and it just makes your gameplay so much smoother and so much better. It even helps with building and it helps a lot with editing. And one more setting if you guys want to come over here. Also, make sure that your matchmaking region is on the, um, which is, is on uh, what region you're on and don't have it on auto. Have it on whichever one you're on because it does lower input delay too. All right. And the last one is if you have performance mode off, turn it on, guys. It helps out so much. The only thing that is, is we, it'll make the builds look kind of bad but you guys could turn this message up and make it look normal but it does make the fps drop but if you guys want maximum performance and you guys want zero input delay and if you guys want to edit fast have performance mode on and a lot of you guys been asking what what do you have on why do your bills look like that's because i have this setting on right here all right guys that's going to click with the first step i was just showing you guys some settings now let's get into the second one all right guys so for a lot of you uh console players and a lot of pc players who play on controller you guys have struggle and times with consistently editing on one cone or one floor or even one wall guys so you guys want to learn how to edit fast i do mention this in a lot of videos on how to slowly time your edits uh so that's what i'm going to be teaching you guys today so if you're like right here and let's say you want to hit a clip on somebody they're right here and then you want to you know do some edits and you want to edit down and you want to buy hit them for right there so i'm going to show you guys how you can do that so a lot of you guys say oh some of my stuff doesn't register consistent edits i want you guys to time it right now i want you to do exactly what i'm doing right here do this and then once you get the muscle memory in and the memory, you guys will be able to actually time it to where exactly it will edit. And I'm telling you guys, you practice like this, literally do this for about five minutes, guys. And then you can start to increase the speed. And then you can go faster. You see how fast it is, guys? All right, guys, so that's the secret to consistently editing in one spot. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to edit while moving fast. All right, guys, so editing while moving fast is more of a challenge than what I just showed you over there because you have to be at the right place at the right time or your edit will screw up and it'll just not be good. So I do suggest that you uh, do the steps that I did before, turn on, uh, confirm edit and release and put your stuff right here, the matchmaker region on which region you're on because it does help reduce input delay. But an easier way that you can edit is by going right here and running up the ramp diagonally. It will almost like 90% of the time confirm your edit at the right time. Or if you guys can't do that, just try running up it slow. You don't have to always run up. Just be like, and then do it. All right, now this guys, this part is for my more intermediate uh, slash pro type status players. Now, if you guys want to edit like LD and stuff, now I know if you guys be like, a lot of you guys be like, oh, um, when I post my retakes, you guys be like, oh, these are intermediate retakes. And a lot of you guys be like, oh, these are too easy. So I'm going to show you guys how you guys can confirm with those retakes very easily and how you could do them really easily because I do do a lot of editing retakes. So 
let's say you want to try to hit an LD type clip, I want you guys to first line up and think of what type of edits you're going to do. Because if you have no clue what type of edits you're going to do and you go just raw on the edit, you're going to end up messing up because then you won't have a set mindset. So what I want you guys to do is take a deep breath in. And let's say you want to do a uh, quadruple edit. So what you want to do is you want to edit this at the base of the ramp, guys, or farther. Because if you don't, it might screw it up. Let's say I try to edit it on it. Boom. Then, look, I'm going to have to place my pyramid and cone, which is going to place over there rather than right here. Because I have no room to place it. So I suggest that you edit at the base of the ramp so you can get the most editing time. Then when you do that, let's say you want to come right here and you want to do a quadruple edit. Boom, you do the quadruple edit, basically a triple edit. So I suggest that you practice a lot of triple edits before you try to do a quadruple edit because literally a quadruple edit is a triple edit just with a cone. So practice editing your cones like this and then practice doing triple edits because those help you out the most when trying to complete a quadruple edit then you'll be able to do like 25 in a row all right guys and last but not least i am going to mention the same thing i mention every video because a lot of you guys seem to go get it use an application called anti-micro this is for pc only i don't know if they're going to create a console type or a console one to where you guys can be able to download on console but this is for pc only guys it's literally an application that gives you zero input delay it is not sponsored like I just advertise this because this I'm trying to show you guys how to get better uh, consistent edits and faster edits. So I do suggest that you guys use this app called Anti Micro. It's really easy to it's really easy and simple to set up. I did make multiple videos on it. I'll leave that down below in the description too if you guys want to use that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope this did help you out, and I hope I did recite some new tips rather than my other videos because a lot of you guys be like, oh, you rehearse the exact same tips every single video. So I just want to make sure that uh, I didn't rehearse the same video, rehearse the same tips in this video but without further ado have a great rest of your day